AKA, that's what 50 do for you. <laughs> right. Just knowing fifth, like getting down with the boss, the big boss, it be real, real, like, you know what I'm saying? It be real, my nigga. Spot of low in the house. Feel good to be home doing what we do. Got my own big work. Got the poop though, the homie her. I got my cousin, my relative, whatever you want to call him, low key. Gee, Bobby. Hey, we got Spot of Loke in the building. Yeah. What's good, fam? Love, young man, it's good to have you in there, man, brother. It's good to be here, man. Let me just start, man, by congratulating you, dog, on everything that you're doing I appreciate without it. even having the, you know what I'm saying? I just done out. Because it's like, after you got from the West, man, on G Unit Records, man. Big up on that. Man. I gotta say thanks to the big boss, 50 Cent, Curtis, yeah. and his coach Jackson, doing the way <laughs> major right now, which is like over obvious. I don't even have to say it. But, uh, you know, we feeding the West. Like, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. It so happened that uh, somebody from over there, and in the, in the, in the, after the surmise, all the East Coast, West Coast drama, that our, our, our upbringing and our, up, our arrival comes from the hands of a G from, from, from New York. I love that. Yeah. He's really a gorilla, too. He let me do my thing, let me run loose, and like, you know what I'm saying? I'm putting it down for the unit. I love the unit. That's you know what, what it's hot, man, because it was crazy, too, to see y'all out there. I, I got to get out to Vegas to see the Get Rich or Die Trying screen. It's kind of lovely out there. Oh, that was a party out exactly. there. <laughs> exactly. That's how we get out, you know what I'm saying? Oh, that was a party, yeah. Celebration. And it was crazy. I had to tell him, I was like, man, you throw a party, homie, like, straight up. When he's he, not, he sit back, so he, like, just observe. Like, yeah. he wants to see you enjoy yourself. He lounging, yeah. yeah. He ain't trying to, like, you know what I'm saying? In the club, he was posting, you know what I'm saying? I didn't quite was... make it to the club, but, uh, oh, you man. know what I'm saying? I kind of <laughs> overheard, like, you know what I'm saying? Bananas. Yeah, no, the after though, party? Wait. It was the after after party. The after after party? I know how they go. Oh boy, yeah, it was, it was a good luck <laughs> over there, man. The soundtrack, man, is, is hot to me. Like, I was like, okay, cool, I wanted to hear it. Right. Like the window shopper joint, like Hustle's Ambition, but the more I started listening to the Get Rich or Die Trying soundtrack, yeah, like it was, Cut, it's Cut. It's a quality effort. It's a quality effort, man, and the whole team that can't, man, seeing y'all out there, y'all get down like a family for real. It's quite cohesive, man. You know, it's, it's a natural family, and even when you think of the word family, Sometimes you say it uh, looks like a family, you might objectively think that that's something that can't be possible. The families aren't perfect. Right. And, and I just want to let you know it is a family. A family, everyone loves each other, everyone loves the opportunity that they have going on. Ups and downs, bumps and bruises, but we got the main objective to make this thing win. And that's, and that's what we all push for. Right, right. What was the one thing, man, that excited you most about getting down with 50 and seeing everything he's done to this point? And now, like, also getting down with someone of that stature and that size and doing so much. Um, besides the, the obvious excitement of just the opportunity, right. it's the fact that when you, when, you, when you actually deal with 50 Cent as an individual, he never reminds you of any things that make him great. He, uh, he deals with you like one-on-one, -on -one. he points out the things that he likes about you and what makes you great. And, and it's, you never get in a position, it, it's easy to celebrate. He makes it real easy to celebrate what he's done and what he's doing. So, and I was excited about being able to be in a, in a situation where everything that I felt proud about myself was exalted. And I didn't have to point at my high, my good points. Word, Nobody, yeah. even people as banks, like Lloyd Banks, someone is, you might perceive to be arrogant as that. They, they have real humble hearts to their inner circles. And uh, I just love them, man. I just love the homies. They the homies, man. How do you link up with them, homie? Like, because everybody listening right now is like, What up, man. Young Buck? And he beat that case when you thought he was going to jail. <laughs> he didn't lose. Young Buck did that for me. Uh, my, my big brother happened to be OT in Nashville, dealing with some people that knew him quite well. Okay. I was in Atlanta, Georgia, doing my thing, kind of frustrated with my music situation at uh -huh. the time. And um, just what happened that um, the people that were in Tennessee traveled to Atlanta to be with me for a couple of days. And we was getting down, and Buck happened to travel to Atlanta to be with them. So we ended up in the same hotel room. And I did, took the opportunity to do like a freestyle rap for him. And he was impressed to the point that um, a week later he was scheduled to be out here to shoot the Shorty Wanna Ride video. He allowed oh, me to man. go to the video shoot with him and I was able to be in front of 50. And I did the same little acapella rap. And immediately when I was finished, he was like, why well, put off to tomorrow, we can do the day. There was some access, granny cameras close by. He, he called him over, he said, I got a new artist from the West Coast named Spider. He started telling certain people to call so-and-so and whoop -so and whoop and asking me a few questions. He said he had to go over to Europe and above for about a period of 30, 40 days. And he was gonna leave in three days. He told me when he got back, he was gonna make it right. And then when he got back, he, yeah. right. <laughs> he did what he did, man. He made it override life. You feel me? Like, when you, when you think, like, way more than I would be satisfied with. Way yeah, that's more. A, yeah. Who you feeling, man, right now? Like, who's in your, who's in your car, man? Who you bumping right now? Uh, 
I got the soundtrack in my car right yeah, now. Me yeah, me too. I came from. Yeah, I got that. Outside of that, um, my little homie J Rock, I'm part of the uh, Nixon Garden Projects. He got a little situation over there uh, at Warner Brothers with okay. the homie Dude Dog, Top Dog Productions. He got some heat. We found out like we were kind of closely related not too long ago. It was like a real shock, one of those real ironic things. So, uh, what up to Lil Rock? Uh, I've been doing some work with my cousin. She's a female artist out here on the West Coast named Gigi on the low. I got a couple of her songs in my, uh, in my CD changer. Besides that, I just got the soundtrack and, and, and G Unit music. What was it with the cast, man? Like, you coming up when you were listening to hip hop that was inspiring to you, man, that made you just want to take that I had to really draw that inspiration and say it made me pick up the pen. It had to be Ice Cube. You know, um, I've appreciated the, the bits and pieces of music from a lot of other people throughout time, but I believe that showing consistency and showing literacy and still being able to grasp the, the harshness and the realities of where we are from, he was head over, over above all. It may have changed a little bit toward, you know, but Jordan can't jump as high as he can jump either. <laughs> right, but right. I think he put it down for years with, you know, with it, and then he never really, you gotta, he never, he never really got a misconception of the person that Q was himself. He was able to keep a balance of reporting what was going on out here very well with a great amount of poetry. And then he remained a gentleman, a gentleman and he remained respected outside of Cam. And then my boy Cam, oh, and yeah. I hate the fact that, you know what I'm saying, their situation is the way it is. But uh, those two, I have to say, like, that was the, the ones, ones right there. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. See, I, I mean, like, hip hop got so many different sounds, man, and it's, and it's crazy to see, like, for yourself, cats who are doing it now. Like, who is it? Who's gonna move hip hop on to the next thing right now? I like, is. Yeah. Yeah, I is. <laughs> Me and mine, the gorillas, man, that's what we're here to do. And if it's not obvious that it's going down, then maybe perhaps you're sleeping. But um, I, I, I feel real privileged to be a part of it, though. Yeah. It's a great time to be on, on, on the set with the homie fifth, man. Yeah, that's why I wanted to get you in here, dog, because being a cat from the coast, you know what I'm saying? I'm from out here, man, Cali, so it was like, I got to get my man. Yeah, and I, and I feel from, it. Man. You know, and we just out in Vegas doing what we do, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. And now we're here. Uh, I appreciate the uh, invite, and I always come through anytime you need me, Chris. You know, the open do. door, dog. No real talk, fighting for real, it. man. So thank you for coming through, dog. I'm gonna listen man. tonight, man, cause yeah, Julio, Julio get down. Julio, like... Yeah, Julio kind of wild a little later, have a little drink in me, so you know what we doing. So and Julio get down. You gonna come in here? The lights gonna be real low. Is that right? Oh yeah, it's going like... down. It's, it's, it's it get down. That's right. the get can down. We, can we change the way the air smell in here? What's... One, night? <laughs> That's what I'm trying to see. It smells great in here right now. I'm gonna say that. Ah, it's my cologne, man. It's a new line. Called yeah. the best. <laughs> <laughs> All right, man. Spider, thanks for coming through, right, big homie. Appreciate it, Chris Lowe. But West so, Rod, Westside Radio, catch the homie Spider tonight, man, with Julio G. Right here on the new 93.5 K Day G.